Hey guys, Head Over Heels coming at you from the closed beta of Revelation Online. I'll be covering the two classes, uh, Spirit Shaper and Occultist. Uh, Occultist is uh, more of a support than anything else, but first we'll cover Spirit Shaper since uh, they're more of the main healer. That way we can, you know, heal people, keep them alive. Anyways, let's get this started. Alright. Going to character creation. So, we're a healer, so we have to be cute and adorable as fuck, my friends. So, let's get started. Alright, let's get the hair going. We're working on the body, so you can either go with the preset, choose whatever the fuck you want, make it easier on yourself, don't have to bother creating your character when you go through presets. I don't usually like going through presets, because I like doing my own thing. So... Anyways, let's go to hair. I like going with the little curls. Makes my character look really adorable. We'll do some green looking hair. Skin. It's a little too pale for me. Let's give it a little tone. That way you can actually see that she has skin. It isn't just some white blob. Alright, the head is a little big. But I don't know if it's the head or if it's the... Let's shrink it down. There we go. Better. See? Much better. Okay, legs. I don't care too much on the legs, so let's just, all I want to do is make her short. Uh, there we go, better. Height, small as possible. There we go. There we go, let's just, we'll keep the apparel going. So that way, she can look adorable while we're doing this. Alright, so that's pretty much it. You can do torso, you can mess with the thickness, hand size, arm size. You can, uh, you can adjust any body part you want to, for the most part, as I know. Anyways, that's the body. Now, face. This is like eyes, makeup, skin, tattoos, stuff like that. So let's give her a little anger mark. Make her mad. Yeah, let's make her angry. What color should we get? Pink? No, pink doesn't show too much. Let's do black. Anger mark. She's angry. She's pissed. She doesn't like anybody. DPS don't know what they're doing. Tank can't oh, fucking hold aggro. Fuck that shit. Okie dokie. Okay, these are the face presets. Or, well, color. I don't know. Anyways, let's go to eyebrows. Eyebrows. It's kind of bushy. Let's try this. A little refined. Can we look her, make her look mad? Let's make her try to make her look mad. What's the angle? Yeah, there we go. Make her look PO'd. That's the healer. Cute, adorable, but very angry. Cute and angry. That's what I like to see. Cute and angry. Make the eyebrows match. Eye size! We can make them big. Small. This is good. Bring up the eyes a little bit. Kind of low next to the nose. Too close to the nose. The eyes are fine for the most part. You can adjust everything else too from pupil size, rotation, angle, distance, whatever. You can increase the eye size even more if you want to, or nothing at all. Make her run around with her eyes closed. There we go, back to 10. You can choose how wide you want them. You can have them short or wide, don't matter. I don't care, do what you want. You can just adjust the eyes a little bit more, whatever. Now this, you can mess with the pupil patterns. You can have whatever you want. I know I like to give her yellow eyes because yellow looks really fucking cool in this game. Let's see, what color, what do we want? What do we want, like evil cat eyes? Do we want the normal? Do we want the fire in your eyes? Do you want that? Do you, fuck, I think I like this, fire in her eyes, she's angry. Gotta have that fire. Now you can also change the, you know, the whites, you can make them black if you want to. So why not, I'll do that with mine, sure. Okay, lashes shave. You got. You can mess with your lashes, and make them even more cute. Uh, yeah, whatever. Just fiddle with that if you want. Eyeshadow. Gotta make them look cool. Let's see. Let's get the brightness. Oh, perfect! I love it. Fucking love it. Amazing. Let's increase the intensity. Nah, not that much. There we go. Perfect. Make it nice and shiny with the skin luster. Okay, so that's your uh, that's your makeup. Makeup's uh, pretty cool, pretty detailed. Easy though. 
All right, we got the lips. I'm not going to focus too much on this, so I'm just going to create the color, increase the brightness. Yeah, there we go. That'll work. Yeah, let's, yeah, let's do this. No smile. Make her angry. Give her some lip fullness. Okay, that's good enough. All right. Her face. Uh, I don't usually go too much into detail because I'm not very good at adjusting facial features. So, in my eyes, I think she's pretty good. Uh, this will work. So, anyways, let's create this. Let's, we're already done fiddling around. Oh, yeah, if you want to check out the wings. I'm not sure if you can get these in-game yet. These are just previews. I actually have not seen them at all. Like, this is the closest thing I've seen to actual wings. But yeah, there's your wings. Alright, we're creating name time. This is, they do your name after all this stuff, so let's do head over heels. Alright, working. Includes illegal characters, my ass! Okay. Let's just try no capital letters but the first one. Awesome! We have successfully created our character. Now we're just gonna get past this loading screen. I gotta take a sip of my monster. I don't need it. Alright. Alright. Come on now, let's load. Let's get a move on. Move it, move it. I like to move it, move it. You like to move it, move it. We like to move it, move it. I don't know the song lyrics, but we like to move it. Bam, bam, bada, bada, bam, 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 bada, bam, 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 Okay, looks like it's almost done. Come on, we're almost there. The music's playing. Come on, you got this! Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Yes! Awesome! I'm gonna try to skip as many cutscenes as I can without avoiding too many of the rewards. Alright, so you can choose which way you really want to play. You can choose non-target where it's like Terra or Blade and Soul, and that way you can just aim freely. It even has the recommended classes, you know, Blade Master, Vanguard, and Gunslinger. I recommend that though, so. Anyways, then there's mouse control. This is kind of like Diablo and other stuff like that if you want to just play with your mouse. That's all you. And then there's the classic MMO thing, you know, move with your WASD and punch in your, your skills with the 1 through 0 kind of thing, which is what I'm going to use at this class. So. Let's get started. Alright, moving out, moving out. Let's do this shit. Okay, so you can either, like, move, or with the WASD, or you just click, you know, it takes you to the next quest, or your quest objective. Yeah, I remember when this game used to be really bad, when I played the second open, the second closed beta. Oh, good lordy, have mercy on those translations. They were horrifying. I couldn't understand a word these fuckers were saying. Alright, now she's, we get to test out our skills. We have the Spirit Bells, which causes uh, thought damage, I guess. Mad Spectral <laughs> Magpie. We're gonna throw birds. <laughs> oh, fuck yeah. Um, then there's Firefly Hex. That's your damage over time. You wanna use that. I usually use my damage over time first if I decide to do damage, then use these, so I'm doing damage, I'm doing as much damage as possible. Um, it looks like Essence of Spring will be your healing skills, but that will be discussed, uh, at a later date. For now, we're just goofing off, fiddling around with the quest. I'll be doing some other stuff, like some trials, some dungeons, PvP possibly. But for now, we're just derping around with some quest. So... Throw a magpie at that bitch. Yeah! Fucking more magpies. Eat shit. Yeah! That's what I'm talking about. Now you talk to her again. Now we go talk to... Oh, now we get to do our quest for our first piece of armor. Fuck yeah! Yeah! Alright. You can sprint with uh, either shift and uh, forward, or you can just double tap forward and you can sprint. You can dodge with double tapping S or double tapping A or D side to side. 
Pretty fun stuff. It's really... It's a fun game. It doesn't have super high graphics or anything. Alright, first piece of armor. Our survivability rate went up. My guess is that's just defense. Alright. Moving on to... Beating up some of these said slings. Well, first, I'm going to reduce the sound a little bit. Oh, nope, I already messed with the sound last night. Fantastic, so it's easier to hear me. Awesome. Alright, let's go uh, over here. Now, these guys are beating up some uh, little egg thing. I guess his name is GB or GG or GG? I don't fucking know. Oh, they're just being a bully. That's all I can tell. Alright, so he wants us to beat him up. Yep, there we go. See, we just... They got some good skills. They do pretty well. Pretty good damage. Beat them up. Yeah, bitch. Eat shit. Okay. And once you're done beating up three of them, you can continue your quest. But let me finish up real fast. Let me just throw birds at these little siegeling things. It's like Pokemon or some shit. Flying type strong against you fuckers. Release the egg. Alright, we got the egg, guys. His name... Oh, his name's GB. GB. Okay, I'm gonna do that. Alright. Now. Onwards. Gotta go find Grandpa. Or Chief. He's the Chief, I guess. Alright. Yeah, this the quest system's pretty simple. You can click on uh, the thing here to get to your quest, or you can just run there or fly or do whatever. Oh yeah, 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 I love woohoo, dragon kite. Fantastic. Let's what uh, what else are we doing? Alright, let's get moving because I got better shit to do than talking to old people. Alright. Now it's telling us about dashing and uh, charging. Now yes, you can glide too, so not for very long, but you can keep pressing space, it'll deplete this uh, levity value bar. Which is how long you can sprint, how long you can jump and glide, how long you can, yeah. Pretty much anything that speeds you up or helps you get across faster. Okay, we're getting a couple frame rate dropping, that's kind of bugging me. Level up, yeah! Okay. Now we're gonna deliver some food. Oh, fuck, look at me go. I'm not even, I'm not even walking, it was more of a, more of a slide, floating thing. Here's your serving food. Here's your food served hot. Holy shit, look at him. He's ginormous. Alright. Also, I'm going to talk to you about gifts. Uh, you get them when you log in. You level up. You get those two. Every nine, le every nine, ten levels, you'll get stuff. Every day, remember to log in and grab these. They are basically experience potions to help you level up quicker. Yeah, you get rewards for staying logged on for about an hour and a half. So stay on, get your rewards. At the third day, you get a level, you get a gold main weapon, or is it a side weapon? I forget which one. Anyways, onwards to talking back to the chef. Okay, let's go over here, talking back to Chiefy. And. There we go. Dun dun da dun 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 dun. Okay. Now we're gonna go to this horn thing. We're looking for some guy named Akuda. Oh, she's gonna blow the horn. Then we see Akuda. Wow, rude. Okay, whatever. Look at this bitch. She's talking shit. I don't understand her either, but I guess I'll jump. She wants me to kill myself, I guess. Break a leg! That's what she's trying to say. As literally as possible. Please don't let me die. Zoom, motherfucker! Yeah! I believe I can fly! I believe I can touch the sky! Whee! See, this is some Blade and Soul shit. Except you get your drop down ability way faster than you would in the Blade and Soul. Okay, dokie. Let's talk to Cranky Mc Mitch. Yeah, Cranky McBitch Pants, or Bitch McCranky Pants. Better. That's easier to pronounce. 
Alright, hey look, it's a Kuda. This guy's trying to be cool, the music's cool, and then it's just like, no longer cool because he falls in the ass. This guy, he doesn't die, but he comes damn near to putting himself unconscious. Wrecked. Okay. Alright. Talking to these guys. Gonna give them some mint leaves. Here you go, buddy. Feel better. Alright. I got a new weapon! Yes! Alright. Jumping fish. What the fuck? A jumping fish? Jumping... What? Okay. Whatever you say, chief. Alright, he wants me to kill some crabbies. Little crabs. Alright, we're rolling in deep, lads. He wants us to beat up some crabs. Alright, Mr. Krabs, give me your money. I'll throw fish at the crabs. Oh my god, he fucked them up so hard. Holy shit. Oh my goodness, that fish tore them to pieces. Yes, beat them up. Oh my god, this class is so much fun already. I get to throw fish at things. Oh. Alright. Next up. We're going to talk to... We're going to turn this in. And he's gonna tell us to get him some food. Now, welcome to the gliding aspect, or the flying aspect of the game. At level 29 or 39, I forget which one, I think it's 29, I'm pretty sure it's 29. But, uh, at 29, you get, uh, at one of those, you get your wings, your first pair. They don't look like this, but, uh, they'll do. It's, flying's a lot of fun. I don't understand why they put ground mounts and you can fly everywhere. I guess it's for some quest, I don't know. Anyways, you fly back, he takes away your wings. Sorry guys, don't keep these. But don't worry, you'll get your own soon enough. Yeah, okay. Alright, hey look, it's party time guys. Party time! Okay. I think I'm going to stop there. Um, next video I'll have will be more of a uh, less questing, more of the action. You know, I'm going to do it. It'll probably be a trial. I know the trials will. No, wait. It'll be a dungeon because trials come after it. Okay. But anyways, you guys will see me then. So more, look for more action on the healer for this game. Make sure to pick up your level up items as well. Every when you hit level nine, they'll start giving you more as you level up. 19, 29, 39, 49, 59, 69 at the end. I know it's a funny uh, level cap for this patch, but oh well. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I hope you guys stay tuned to watch more of Revelation Online with the Spirit Shaper. Bye bye